do do do. Careful. Oh, he has a butt on his head. Yeah. yeah. Butt head. Yeah. Get it? Yeah, I got it. Okay. Are you sure you got it? Because you didn't seem too happy about yeah, it. Yeah, you didn't even laugh. Well, why would I laugh? He's trying to kill me. This is a lot of zombies. Because we called him butthead. It's a lot of zombies. It's not that much. What would you consider that much? If there wasn't an inch of space in the room to walk, that's a lot of zombies. But then you would also be a zombie because you would be dead by then. No, because he's not in the room. He was. That's what I'm saying. That's why it's not a lot of zombies, because you could actually physically move into the room and move around and do stuff. There's a spitter somewhere. There he is. He lived through your little special ability. I saw. But not for long. Watch out for the man scientist. Next. Ooh. Ooh. He dope for you. Motherfucker got some air. I dodged it. Yeah, nice back step. Right? Fuck these zombies. I need to cook somewhere. Yeah, okay. You tried to go with Michael Jordan on you. Get some hang time. It's Michael Jordan's way better than I am. <laughs> well, duh, that's why I said he tried to go with Michael Jordan. Jordan's like the best there ever was. Yeah. When That's he played, true. yeah. True. True. Of his generation, for sure. Put yeah. it in perspective. It's just another one of the things like, yes, basketball is still mostly the same, but I don't know if he'd be as good if he had to play today. It's hard to say. Who knows? Don't let him hear you say that. <laughs> it's so funny because I hear things like, like people say that, you know, basketball nowadays, it's so amazing because of what we're seeing people do. And it's like, but basketball really, back when I Jordan hate played, basketball I really do. Right, I do too. And to me, I'm like, but when Jordan played basketball back in the day, it wasn't a foul to grab somebody's jersey. No, you had to. You, you had when, to earn. When your Jordan foul. played, you had to earn it. You had to earn that foul. The thing that upsets me the most about basketball nowadays, I mean, no disrespect to Curry, everything he does is, you know. He's a great good. shooter. He's great. But that's the thing. All these kids nowadays are trying to be like Curry and shoot Just the three. Shoot. And yeah. they struggle to make fucking layups. And it's like... Right. The layup should be the shot you're trying for. You shouldn't be aiming for a three-pointer. Mm -hmm. I did not find a hack thing. Right. At least, you know, when we learned basketball, that's the way we were taught. Right. Uh, the biggest thing for me is just because I've always been a defensive person, and the, the right. NBA today is entirely designed for offense to dominate. Did I miss a code up here? Yeah, so no, it totally is. I mean, that's why nowadays, like the best basketball for me that's fun to watch is the NCAA tournament. Oh, that's yeah, always that's, fun to that's watch. Just not up here. Plus, you never know who's gonna win. Right. True. The sad part about the NBA is literally for three years in a row, they, everybody yeah. has said they, Golden they, State. Versus Cleveland. Right. Because, yeah. I mean, who else is going to be in it? Who else is going right. to make that? Right. Top left. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, no, for some reason, that's that's what we're stuck with, you know? Like, that's not good. Right. Well, and I mean, you kudos have to those players and stuff for, you know, being that good. Three years in a row, right. Good. Yeah, I'll give them the kudos for that. I'm not saying anything against that, but... Right. But, but it, right, makes, it's, it's, it it's, makes the rest of the NBA just seem eh. Yeah, it's like, why yeah, watch it's just this team play when we know they're not going to go anywhere? Oh, fuck you. Why is that shooting at you? Because it shoots at everything. Why is it not shooting at him? It is now. Oh, let me see. Why don't you just let them go until they die and see what happens? I haven't planned on it. You might be able to get all of them. You got all that of them. That was the goal. Nice. It's almost like New England in the Super Bowl. Right. Well, shit, based on everything I've seen and heard thus far about this season in the NFL, we might as well not even play and just give the Super Bowl trophy so New to England. New England. There's yeah. no point in playing it, apparently. New England and Dallas. <laughs> and even then, Dallas is just a, a whisper, yeah. given right. everything. I'm it's, just saying, because like, New England's that team where it's like, oh, New England's a Super Bowl again. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> right. like, no one's surprised if New yeah, England right. makes it to the Super Bowl at this point. Right. Yeah, it's just, like I said, based on everything I've... I mean, nobody's giving any team in the NFL a chance at all. No. Everyone has already given the Super Bowl ring to 
Brady, Brady again. Yeah. And well, they do every year. Oh, I know. I get why they're putting Dallas up there. You're right. Dallas. I don't. I I actually think Dallas. I don't think Dak don't is going to have as good of a year. Agreed. But Dallas has definitely come around. Oh yeah, they're um, Dallas. I believe they'll make. I think they'll make the playoffs again. Oh, they'll easily for sure. They'll easily make the playoffs again. Um, I think Philly will be their biggest challenge in that division. If uh, what's his face, Wentz. Figures yeah, sure. can grow and learn a lot. Yeah, New York will be pretty tough though too. New York's always weird. You never New York know. Is yeah, always New, weird. York's, <laughs> New York's you never a big know. wild card, and I think uh, Washington's just gonna struggle. Yeah, especially since they lost um, what's his face cousin to, to Tampa. Yeah, wow, Tampa took him. No, Tampa didn't get him. No, not Tampa. Who who let somebody left Washington and went to Tampa? Um, no, oh, Deshaun. Ah, thank you, Deshaun Jackson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I was say why the hell would Tampa take him? What's his face? Sorry, not proved. He struggled at the beginning, but what's his face came around late Did, in the season. Was it Tampa that he went to? I think so. somebody big left Washington and went to Tampa because I remember we even talked about it on one of our earlier shows. Did oh, we? Because we were saying that Tampa Bay was going to be pretty decent next year. Tampa Bay surprised a lot of people last year, and that's why I said they just they just got better in the offseason. Yeah. Well, right. Well, and they also got the tight end from in the draft, the best tight end in the draft. Oh, good for them. I don't know. That. I don't watch Howard. the draft. I, I, yeah, I can't. The draft, the draft bugs me. I kind of like it. It's fun. I guess it's if you're really into football, I can understand why it'd be fun to watch it. Like especially for, um, like, our friends and stuff who watches college and then see those guys. I say that's probably yeah. the people yeah. it stuff affects like that. So like, when you when you watch football that much, I'm not really that into football. So that I like I I would like to say that I am. I'm not that much of a football nerd. Um, the funnest part for me is I went with a whole bunch of friends and we did a draft party <laughs> thing uh-huh. where you played draft day bingo. Oh, that's fun. And so you do things like... You gotta upgrade there for one of your weapons. <laughs> for the for bingo, you know, you do things like... Um, oh, nice. Thanks his mother, or, you know, thanks God, and then you, like... Um, see which one they do when they come pin, up. Pinstripe suits, you know, things like that. And so if you see it when they it. come up... Um, one of my favorite ones that they had a little while ago was... Uh, or that we did this year was... Uh, high fives in the war room. Nice. You know when I always it'll jump into the war room and they're all high fiving. So that's that's why I like going. Well, to if the you're draft gonna do that, for. sure. Right. I'm just saying, like the draft as a whole to me is not appealing because I don't really watch college football I, right, at all. I agree. Like that. It's well, just I, I wait for the next year to show up and I watch it go. And I look to right. see <laughs> who my team gets and that's about it. That's about, and I just checked the stat line for that. Who did mm-hmm. who did we pick? And that's, but see, that's what I care football's most gone downhill for me to watch. There's just so many fucking commercials. That's my biggest problem with watching football. The yeah, action's fine. The the games itself are fun to watch. It's just like we have to break twenty times. That and I'm still. I mean, they're doing the same thing in football that they're doing in the NBA, right? Like offense sells yeah, tickets. Make, yeah, which they're making sure. Yeah, they're it's making stupid. it way easier to be offensive than defense. Because I was like, I went back. I didn't go back. It was just every time the Super Bowl rolls around, they play old Super Bowls in that um, New England or not New England, um, Green Bay Denver one showed up. Oh my God! And the the play where McCaffrey just knocks that fucker on his ass and then points at him on the ground, and we scored a touchdown off. It's like, yeah, if that was in today's games, that's a penalty coming back 15 yards. Right. <laughs> And all the fucking holding and chop well, blocks how about, and shit you see go down. And how about like, when none Steve of Atwater like took out him and the other our other safety? I can't think of his name right now. Oh, yeah, when the big helmet, 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 helmet to helmet. And they took out the Green Bay wide receiver at the same time. Yeah. Well, they more took each other out. The Green Bay guy well, kind of slinked out okay. He but, slinked no, out I know okay, what you mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I he mean, definitely led with the yeah. head. That would oh, be a yeah. penalty, 15 right. mm-hmm. yards, ejection. All kinds of fines. I get it. They're trying to make it safer on some of those I, things. Right, it is understandable. For that, I'm fine. You right. never need to have a helmet to helmet, right? Like Agreed. safety no, of the players is fine. No, but, it's just I was just saying, like, go back and look at the way defense was played there compared oh, yeah. to today. Yeah. And what's a penalty on of just like a regular, like what you would call more like a tap penalty? Yeah, that's called nowadays. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's like wow. The other thing I can't stand is that you have, um, like, going back to that. Like player safety, right? Right. All of them are fighting for. Oh well, we don't want to have concussions, and we don't want this. But then, if they get a concussion, they want to stay in the game. Yeah. But then afterwards, they're like, "No, I shouldn't stay in the game." But when it comes into it, they're like, "No, I need to stay in the game." It's like, okay, pick one or the other. The the biggest 
problem I have with the new penalties and stuff, and it's it's not that it's a penalty, it's how it's enforced. And that's the fucking illegal contact. Yeah. Five yard automatic first down. Yeah. Either make it a ten yard penalty automatic first down or take away the automatic first down. Right. Every I agree defensive with that. fucking penalty is an automatic first down. Because right. that's just fucking Which is stupid. stupid. Agreed. Because if it's third the and seventeen, all anything. they gotta do is get yeah. that illegal contact and then it's a first down. And half the time that's what they do. They yeah. run into the they try to cornerback trying contact. to get it to go. Yeah, it's frustrating to watch nowadays. I'd miss the good old Baltimore Pittsburgh games. Those were where it was nine games. to six from just field goals. Yeah. Well. But anyways, we'll save the rest for the next episode. Sounds like a plan. Are you in? Click subscribe. Press that like button down below. We are the Shadow Legion.